so if you are thinking that my professional life is not growing exponentially because generally in it we expect exponential growth right after getting experience maybe one year experience two year four year five year six year 10 year 11 12 year 15 years like this we have expectation of growth if you are thinking that i am not getting that growth which i was thinking before joining this company or maybe before starting your career in this industry when you had entered what was your expectation right so you know sometime many people are stuck at knock level they don't like the job every day same task on same protocol they don't like people want to change but they are not able to change reason is very simple technical skill if they are applying for job in let's say scl company scl is asking question from open standard protocols like bcp ospf mp bcp mpls so people are not able to crack the interview because they don't know these industry used protocols these are the protocols which are running in the industry every time interview is asking question from these topics only right interview can give you scenarios like this is the scenario this is the issue how you will fix it but if you are thinking that okay prof fully if i have only one years of one year of experience then also they are going to ask these types of question yes brother if you are the fresh and you want job in the industry this industry networking industry if you are the completely fresher want to get job you have to earn good hands up hands on experience as a fresher without hands on it's very difficult to get job in the industry hands on means whatever things we are running in the real network real time in the production let's say bcp ospf mp bcp mpls every video you should have good command on it and you should be able to crack the interview as well definitely if you have the knowledge you can answer to the interviewer and you can crack the interview that's why i decided to cover these protocols ospf bcp mp bcp vpn and mpls right many more protocols are there inside these headings these are the headings like the vrf and those all things so i think i will take 1 to 1.5 month see i cannot promise the duration because i am going to start this type of course for the first time i delivered training for ccna ccnp combo sd wan right for many other courses mpls but every time my expectation was teaching the syllabus i teach the syllabus first and then if you have time share your past experience that's why i decided to start this course and you know better about yourself if you are thinking no i am good no need to learn no need to update the self everything is going well no problem who think no i already know these all wow then wow for you definitely you will grow in your professional life definitely you will get exponential growth if you know these protocol every day users are connecting with internet the network size is growing 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 many network engineers are in demand but you know people are not able to handle the network situation because of knowledge only because lack of knowledge they are not expert and if i will talk about myself guys i have 
10 plus years of experience in this industry in the networking industry i worked in various company even i started my career from the field installing the devices connecting the devices those work in the starting career then i entered in it in the it i worked as a network engineer senior network engineer knock engineer tech engineer network architect nowadays i am working as a network architect by the way in one of the top mnc company of the world at the same time i am founder of tm networking apart from this sometime i am taking corporate training so i am involving myself in multiple things just for one reason that is experience i involve myself in these all just for one reason experience i need experience why i need experience i need experience to share with my subscriber followers